The Sound Lab. 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 Experimenting with the best new music. I'm going to chat with Twisted Wheel. Hello. How are you? I'm, I'm very well, thank you. Good. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's a uh, beautiful day. Yeah, I've, we found some shade, yeah. which is nice. Yeah, it is. Yeah, yeah. We, we've been in the bus on the, for like four hours on the motorway in traffic jams, so yeah. really, it's nice just to be free and walking around. That's now. how you want to spend your day, isn't it? Well, yeah, when, you, when you've got to a gig like this coming mm. up at the end of it, well, it's all right, you know. Yeah, yeah Reading and Leeds. Yes. How, how, you looking forward to the day ahead? Yeah, we can't wait. Really can't wait. We've got, um, last, last year we played on, we opened the uh, Radio 1 stage, so it was, uh, obviously it was, a, it was an honour to be playing at the festival, yeah. and it's a great, it's a great stage, but first on, it's, it's <laughs> a tough one, man, uh, especially with our music, because we're quite lively, we're like, you know, quite punk influenced, so. Yeah. Uh, it was a tough one, but it went down well, and uh, through that we've managed to back a slot this year. So festival with, with public stage um, at five fifty, which is a top top time to be on. Yeah, you sounds know. good. Yeah, definitely. And uh, you've been releasing a couple of uh, new singles recently. Tell us about them. Yes. Uh, so we yeah we've been recording the album. Uh, so the first single we dropped a few months back was called Nomad Hat. Um, and it, it went down really well. We did, did actually bring an EP out when we got back together because we were split up for like yeah. five years. So the EP came out last summer, which got number one in the physical charts, which I was really happy about. Okay. Um, but the uh, the single, none of them tracks going to be on the album, album. So the single Nomad out, it went down really well. Uh, it's like the crowds are singing it already at the gigs all the way through. So we've actually yeah. uh, decided to uh, open the set with it. Uh, which is great to be opening a set with a brand new song, yeah. you know, it's quite ballsy really, so uh, Yeah, but then DNA, which is the latest uh, song we brought out a few weeks back um, Which sort of shows a different side of the band um, It's quite got a classic feel to it, a bit of Neil Young in there um, A bit of Freebird by Leonard Skinner, sort of a bit of guitar solo at the end uh, It's a quite an emotional song uh, that I wrote, so uh, yeah, people have really connected with that one. Um, yeah, so looking forward to playing yeah. it. And I'm guessing we're gearing up towards an album. Yes, the album, yeah, yeah, yeah. Got, got two more songs to do vocals on, uh, and a bit of uh, strings, strings to add, yeah. a bit of mixing, and then it, it'll be out in November, hopefully. Good. Yes. Yeah, fingers crossed for that. Yeah. And uh, how's it sounding compared to the releases that were there back? before you split up and the EP, how is it comparing to to now? Um, it's, it's definitely changed, uh, obviously we've matured, but um, it, it's just, it feels a lot more sort of uh, me meaningful, sort of, uh, there's a lot more depth to it. Um, like I said before, there's a more of a classic sort of sound. The early stuff we did, like the demo before we bought the first album was very much punk, you know, and we got we got a lot of praise from bands like the Buzzcocks and Paul Weller from the Jam and stuff like that, uh, which was nice. Mm. But um, this stuff's gone more down, sort of. There's a bit of a new wave, sort of, uh, like like Echo and the Bunny Men, and uh, Joy Division vibe there, but with a uh, sort of classic classic rock, sort of Neil Young. Uh, there's a bit of Zeppelin in there. Mm -hmm. um, so it's a good mix of, of good stuff, man. You yeah. Know? So uh, it, it, yeah, it, it's definitely different. But um, like you know, what what we've played to the fans so far has gone down really well. So I'm thinking that it's going to go down well with the old fans and hopefully get us new ones. Good. Yeah. Sounds great. And uh, you did split up back in 2011, was it? I think. Something yeah, like around there, about around maybe a little bit later. Maybe a little bit later. Yes. Um, was it always a plan to get back together, or at the time did you think that was kind of it? No, not at all. It, uh, it ended quite sour. Um, the, the the two lads I started the band with left first, and I got two new guys in, did a second album, uh, and then and then we then we then we fell out, and then I got a three more lads in so it was a four piece which we are still a four piece now but um we started to record uh, and then we split up um and uh, i never thought i'd get the band back together at all um the bass player it wasn't actually his right to do this but he actually announced on facebook and twitter uh, in the middle of the night rest in peace twisted wheel but i'd never said the band was finished ah. so when i woke up in the morning there was thousands of shares and comments yeah. uh, so i just thought maybe it's just what it's meant it's the way it's meant to be mm -hmm. uh, and uh, and then i sort of just like i went off the rails man and just sort of stopped playing my guitar and uh, i i sort of lost the plot for a bit uh, and uh, luckily, like you know, I've managed to uh, like find my way again, yeah. and uh, yeah, we're back. Good. So and enjoying it, uh, loving it, mate. Good, loving it, yeah. And uh, hopefully hitting the road 
soon? Yeah, yes, yeah, we've just, well, we've, we, were, we was on tour before the festival season yeah. and uh, we uh, we had a little break, then we done we did Why Not, um, Kendall Carlin, uh, obviously Leeds and Reading, yep. um, we've got a few of us and then we go back on tour in October, uh, so it's the UK, uh, we've got a gig, gig in Dublin, um, we're going up to Scotland, uh, Berlin as well. Yeah. So uh, yeah, we're getting getting back getting back to all the places we haven't been for for ages and new places where we've we we sort of developed fan bases in places where years ago we didn't. So as time, what's really sort of uh, made made me made me want to do this even more is the fact that as time's gone on. The music's like sort of it's still important to people, yeah. so it's it's looking like it's timeless, uh, and that was my goal when I started writing songs to make timeless music. So mm. the fact that you know the kids, uh, the the new kids are loving the old stuff, and uh, it's still Im important to people, you know, means a lot to me. That so. Good. You know, job done on that that side of things. Good. And what's the plan for 2020? Um, obviously, like the album will be out. So I think after after the album comes out and we've done the tours, uh, we want to obviously get some festivals nailed down again. So yep. we, we we're looking forward to getting that sorted out. We've got to get, get uh, Glastonbury next year. Mm. Um, we want to get on. We want to get on on a support tour with somebody like Miles Kane or uh, you know someone who's quite similar um, uh, Jamie T or something like that yeah. it would be nice uh, and we've also been experimenting a little bit more on the hip-hop side of things because okay. uh, we, we, we do like a lot of different types of music between us all so we were thinking about dropping some random singles out next year uh, just to test, test the water sort of thing yeah, maybe out. get some features you know like see if someone wants to uh, drop, drop, a, drop a 32 bar rap on a track or, or something like yeah, that yeah yeah um, so so yeah that, that's it and, and the fourth album man you know as soon as this album's out uh, it's you know getting on with the next one really good uh, i think it's just the best thing for for us to do as a band i've worked out is just to keep delivering music you know and building it up that way you yeah. know and uh, you know the more we shout eventually they'll listen you know good excellent well it's been a pleasure having a chat with you yes cheers. thank you very much thank you very much cheers mate cheers thank you nice. the sound lab 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 experimenting with the best new music